So um, you were in uh, the movie Lincoln, uh, done by Steven Spielberg. Yes, I was. Um, <laughs> what was that experience like, and uh, where can we see you in the movie for those of us who have seen it or want to see it again? Well, um, first of all, go out and rent the movie right away because I get a, a little royalty every time it gets rented. Um, <laughs> so, so I get that little check at the end of the year. Uh, there's a scene about eight or ten minutes into the movie where Lincoln uh, does a flagpole dedication at, uh, I guess that it's supposed to be a, a supply depot of some sort or, or supply department for the federal government in the Washington, D.C. area. And uh, it, although it was actually filmed at uh, the, the old train station at uh, Old Town Petersburg, Virginia. And he walks up to the flagpole to, to crank up the flag and he takes off his hat, pulls out his spectacles, puts them on, pulls out a little piece of paper, puts his hat on, unfolds the paper. It's just like that and he says, he, he says, my job is to raise the flag. Once up, it is for the people to keep it up. That's my speech. <laughs> And then the band plays, We Are Coming, Father Abraham, and the crowd sings, and, and, uh, and uh, Mr. Lincoln goes on his merry way. And that's the scene. I, I actually got a three-second close-up in it, even. Really? Yeah, nice. yeah. My mom says, there's Jeff! <laughs> <laughs> watch it tonight when I get home. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I was actually playing an over-the-shoulder baritone horn and I had grown a goatee for it. Yep. So I, I'm, I look very Civil War in Experience was wonderful. Uh, Mr. Spielberg was was fantastic. His first assistant director was amazing. Uh, he he had had uh, broken his ankle or his foot or something. And was was in a cast, running around on crutches, directing you know, setting up the shots and and so on. Mr. Spielberg came in and set up a bunch of shots. We did some rehearsals, uh, shot the scene several times, and by 11 a.m. we were done. <laughs> really? Yeah, it, and and. Afterwards, uh, we did a couple of events with Mr. Spielberg, uh, including uh, the, I think it was 149th Remembrance Day at Gettysburg, where he was the guest speaker. And his, you know, we, we had inquired about getting photos taken with him, and his people were like, no, Mr. Spielberg isn't going to be able to do that. And so, so we were set up next to the actual Marine Band. We were representing the 1865 Marine Band, and the actual President's own Marine <laughs> Band was next to us, so that was quite a thrill also. Yeah. And uh, so we all march over to the monument to, you know, the band marches over to the monument to, to have our picture taken. And Mr. Spielberg comes running over. He says, hey, it's my band. Yeah, how are you? You know, and pumps our hands and poses for pictures with us and everything. He was just, just super. And, and we've done, I think we did another event where he was, he was similar to that. You know, it, was, it was like, hey, guys, it's my band. Get over here. <laughs> so, That's fantastic. So, uh, so it, it was wonderful working, you know, working for you know, for him. I mean, I had my hair done by the same stylist, chief stylist who did Leonardo DiCaprio's <laughs> hair in Titanic. <laughs> so uh, one degree of separation from Leo exactly. DiCaprio. Yeah, one, one <laughs> instead of one handshake. That's away. it, <laughs> exactly. And and uh, the the whole experience was wonderful. Yeah. Just 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 fantastic. Yeah.